the rain's finally dying down a little bit, so I can do an update on this. I got both the tanks out of the Z's. The 70 tank is full of fuel that stinks horribly. And then the 70 free tank is pretty empty and actually pretty clean for how long it's set. They're still both disgusting though. Absolutely disgusting. Here's an update on like the 70 interior. I got the dash and everything for this. I got the original 70 center console as well. I found a wheel for it too and I love that thing. I'm gonna run it just like that, I think, whenever I get it going. Here's the hole from the lack of gas tank in this thing. That wouldn't come loose and stripped itself, so I had to hammer the tank out of the car to slide it out of there, but I got it. As you see, cobwebs and everything. And also, all of the bushings are gone completely on this thing. Kind of an update on the passenger side. The passenger side floor pan, as you can see, is gone. It was gone before, but it was still kind of resting on the edges, so I cut as much as I can out and I'm making some floor pans for it, ordering some, I should say. So, um, here's a slight reveal. RX-7 in its current stage. I'm going to have this thing running pretty soon. I actually bought a new clutch master, new slave cylinder, and it's a pretty nice car. It's like it's sitting out forever. And the holes in the cowling are from something. That's how you don't get pulled over right there, I think. I think that's what they put it on there. Red interior, red seats, royal crown bag for the shifter. It's genuinely kind of sick car. I really like the wood wheel on these two. But yeah, it's pretty nice in here. It's just dirty. It's got a little bit of rust that you can barely see, but still, it's not that bad. It's not as bad as the 70. There's another hole. There we go. This one should be a good driver when it gets done, though. It's a... This one's a 73, so it's last year 240. It's, I don't think it has the original L24. I think someone has painted, or not painted, but put a motor in it or blew up the original motor. It's like, the original motor's not gonna be that clean. Someone's painted the block. The inside of the heads were clean. And like, they got all this hop up stuff. Like it's got stuff to keep the fuel line from getting hot. It has a header. I put that new oil filter on it because the old one, the gasket or the seal at the bottom that these have, was completely gone. Like, completely gone. It was pouring out oil. There's the mess of oil from it. It went sticking everywhere.